YouTube, what is up? Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we are finally checking out the South Park post special. I know some of y'all been waiting for a minute, but your boy's been a little bit under the weather, so I didn't want to do a whole one hour video. You know what I'm saying? When I'm not feeling 100%, I'm still not 100%, but I'm definitely a lot better than what I was a couple days ago. Y'all already know the drill. Full reaction is over on Patreon. Link to that is in the description below. Y'all ready for this one? Let's run it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. And now, a Paramount Plus made for TV movie. It's not a movie. It's a made for TV movie. What? Verdant canyons of Arizona. People are Arizona? News of all. Things are finally getting back to normal. Infections are at an all-time low. New, stronger vaccinations have ebbed the tide. And we humans are cleaning up the mess and finally getting on with... Damn, they burned down the Zoom building. Pandemic have on children. Incoming call for Stan Marsh. We are starting Stan? to win the war against Stan, COVID. Stan, the phone's for you. Stan! What? Oh, shit. That what was definitely blah, 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 definitely on some Randy Marsh ish, bro. So we got a grown ass man stand bars, and uh, the pandemic is just now wrapping up. How long did that shit last for? Yeah, dude, but I'm busy working. Working on getting <laughs> drunk again. I'm not getting drunk. I'm an online whiskey consultant. I'm doing research. Research. Kyle. Hi, is this Stan Marsh from South Park? Oh, dude, it, it is you. <laughs> it's crazy, right? Like, maybe I didn't realize it, or maybe it wasn't obvious. It's just obvious here. All right, so he's talking to Kyle, but Kyle low key sounds like Gerald, right? And then Stan is, he doesn't sound like Randy, but he's acting like Randy. I've never noticed that with them when they were kids, but just this brief adult interaction, I see their parents or their dads all over it. I'm good. I'm. I know this is weird. We haven't talked since. Yo, that's crazy. You should come back here. There's a lot going on. There's nothing in South Park for me, Kyle. I'm not going back there. Us friends said we'd always be there for each other when things got bad. What do you mean? What's happened? Stan, it's Kenny. He's dead. <laughs> Again? Oh, nah. Tonight's guest, First Lady Tom Kardashian. <laughs> oh! Wow, what a terrific audience! No! What a fantastic audience! Wow! I thought I thought it was gonna be Jimmy Kimmel, not Jimmy the um. Damn, what's his last name? Jimmy Jimmy Vollmer. I mean, they have fabulous food. Their country has amazing beaches, and they're really fantastic people. Wow, what a great audience. Nah, that's crazy. You can technically say he made it. You know what I mean? But we're born by. Have you seen this? Have you heard about this? What? I'll tell you one thing. Those people are brave and deserve every ounce of our respect. <laughs> Damn, woke is. Corporate, they want you to cut the hummus joke. What? It's hard enough doing comedy these days. Now I'm getting notes doing commercial breaks? You're just gonna have to joke about something else. All right, fine. What else is going on in the news? Quick. Ah, uh, Jesus. Anything else? Uh, that famous eccentric scientist died. The millionaire philanthropist, Dr. McCormick? Wait, 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 wait. Very mysterious circumstances. That's what doctors are saying about the death of beloved scientist and humanitarian, Dr. Kenny McCormick. Oh, sh he worked tirelessly some say balls out crazily on new inventions and theories but somehow his biggest questions seem to elude him kenny was so brilliant that most of the time we couldn't even understand <laughs> what he was saying <laughs> me neither bro tell tom kardashian to suck my popsicles that are in the green room and that i'm very sorry and that he's a fantastic person go ahead jimmy Oh, he's in a Tesla that drives itself. That's the town you grew up in? Yeah. Well, how does it feel to be back after all these years? It feels sh okay, can you please shut up? Damn, son. You're not going to let me help you through this. Alexa, stop. What? 
She's not real, bro? Nah. Come on, Stan. You've been beefing with a, an operating system this whole time? Plus, oh, because you got like an extra piece of the building. Damn. Nah, that's crazy. Oh! All for groceries. Dogs wear glasses now? Vegan, halal, kosher, improbable meat. Come taste the difference. Nah, that's kind of creepy. This is crazy, huh? I mean, how long has it been? What have you been up to? Oh, dude, just all kinds of stuff, you know, getting stuff going. I got my own online whiskey consultant gig. I'm totally happy. What about you? Oh, I'm getting things going too. I'm doing a sort of counseling online startup thing. Really doing great. Everything is online now. But I hope we can put that aside. Dude, to Kyle, I'm just here for Kenny. All right, well, there's something you should know about the way Kenny died. Hi guys, welcome to Denny's Applebee's Max. Now, of course, it is the future, so we don't have any meat on the menu, because you know, here in the future, we've all decided meat is wrong. Now nah, that's crazy, bro, because that's kind of how it feels. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got that vegan meat, which makes zero sense. Why y'all calling it meat if it's not meat? You feel me? Um, every everybody's trying to not everybody, but like all these restaurants are like pushing vegan options. Nah, this is this is wild. If this is what the future is like, bro, it's gonna be fucking sad. That of course is because here in the future we've all learned that insects are a valuable and sustainable food, and we no longer fear it as food. Mm -hmm. It's the future. We've learned to all just get along and love each other. Why is he talking to them like they don't live in current times? You get me? He felt like there were people responsible for everything that's happened. Oh. Like who? That's just it. Nobody knows. But whoever these people are, they- Oh, sh it's token. Just before he died, Kenny was texting me that he was on to something huge. And he was texting me too. And the hospital won't say how. That's us. Just thinking, oh my God, they killed Kenny. <laughs> And it makes sense. I'm just here for the funeral. I don't want to be a part of anything else. Dude, there might be people to blame for ruining our childhoods. Maybe we can call Jesus and Santa and ask them for help. Is that what you want? It's the future, you guys. Grow up. Will Jesus and Santa make an appearance today? To the Super 12 Motel Plus. Super 12 is crazy. Okay, I see you're in one of our Mach 10 Super Plus rooms. Now, of course, we only take Bitcoin and other cryptocurrency because, you know, it's the future. We've all decided centralized banking is rigged, so we trust more and fly by night Ponzi schemes. Yeah, that's crazy. So you walked out on all your friends and then just hung out at a bar all day? Alexa, just go throw yourself out a window. Alexa, turn on the TV. Oh, God, you are such a piece of. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm sorry. I'm trying to fucking helpful. Damn, Why don't you son. grow up and start acting like an adult for once in your life? Alexa, stop! You! John, I'm standing out. It's crazy, right? Because she might have stormed out, but low key, she did what he asked her to do, which was stop. To Dr. Kenny McCormick. There's still no word from the hospital on what exactly killed Kenny McCormick, but letters sent to multiple news outlets reveal that he might have known his life was in danger. Dr. McCormick said, quote, My closest friends will know where to find it. Dr. Damn. Kenneth McCormick. He just put everybody in jeopardy with that. Because the future certainly sucks. Damn. Oh, I just seen a shirt like this at the mall. Matter of fact, I did my kid cop that. Yeah, so this is where it's from. That's cool. I know. Kenny was on to some bad people and he hid something for us to find. Yeah, I saw. Only problem is I don't know what he's talking about. It doesn't mean that you were right about everything during the pandemic because you weren't. Okay, well, obviously we're never going to agree on certain things, so we shouldn't talk about them. Are we about to see Cartman? Hello? Hello. Testing. Testing. Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Amazing hey, to see you all here for Kenny's, Kenny's Wake. wake. 
Wow, what a great audience. <laughs> wow, what a great audience. Jimmy Vollmer and uh, I had to take an- Yo, are those the um the gothic kids? Hold on. For those of you who don't know, my name is Jimmy Vollmer and uh, I had to take an Asian airline to get here today. Airline. Wow. Look at the goth on the, uh, the goth kids on the left. You know, I had a friend once who was a Polish hairstylist. Talk about an amazing haircut at an affordable price. <laughs> Hold on. Who else? Do we recognize anybody else here? Is that Tweak right there? Um, next to the dude in the blue with the golden shoulder pads. Who else, bro? Who else? Oh, there goes a strong woman right there. Why she look the same though? Oh shit! You got Mimsy in the back and uh, what's his name? Nate Nathaniel. Who else? Who else? I think that's all I recognize for now. And then obviously you got the girls right here. You got the dirty kid right there. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. What is this? Yeah. Hi, it's Wendy. Oh. Wendy, Testerberger, wow. Yeah, my husband, Darwin. Hey, pal, how are you? Hey, guys, it's Tweak and Craig. Oh, hey, how are you? Oh, so that was Craig. How's everything with the family? Yeah, I so I was right with uh, Tweak. Find out what happened to Kenny. I think this goes deeper than you guys realize. Hey, Stan Marsh, good to see you. Well, it's me, Clyde Donovan. Oh, sh me too. Sucks about Kenny, huh? Hope they find all the information on that thing he hid. You know where he might have hid it? No, I don't. But I bet someone here does. Sometimes I think the pandemic really aged me. Kyle, can I talk to you for a second? Dude, he's here. Who's here? Cartman? Yeah. Oh, where? Since we've seen each other. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yes 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 holy sh nah this is good to see right here bro wow it really changed me for the better it did no he's with me right right but i found real meaning in the torah and then i found a great jewish woman and okay just knock it off fat ass dude i don't blame him i don't blame him it's not funny cartman stop pretending you have a happy jewish life hey shugana i'm sorry i couldn't wait in the car anymore i had to meet your friend i was legit it's about you all it must have been amazing to grow up in these beautiful mountains can we stop this and talk about kenny please oh is that uh yeah, that's that's Kyle. Yeah, I'm sorry, honey. Can you just give me a couple minutes? I just need a few more seconds with them, and I'll be right out to the car. Bye, Mrs. Cartman. Okay, that's crazy. Me too. Well, so then maybe he also told you that he was trying to find the origin of the coronavirus. He was clearly onto something, and then he died. I know we all want to solve this. Is he taking it all the way back to Randy and uh, Mickey Mouse? You don't believe a word of that. You're just doing all this to get a rise out of me. Kyle, you really think I would spend 40 years of my life just to get a rise out of you? The pandemic lasted 40 years? Holy crap. I'll see you at Kenny's funeral tomorrow. Maybe he's really changed. No, he is f with me. What if he is f with him? Yo, he got a kid that looks just like him. Sometimes I feel like things weren't supposed to be like this. Is that what you're saying, Dr. McCormick? I guess what I'm trying to say, Dr. McCormick, is- Damn, I thought we were gonna hear him. Let me put it another way. We've all- Bro, let him speak. ...concept of this mysterious organization who is to blame. Let me put Hang it on a another second. way, Dr. McCormick. What was McCormick. that? Freeze video and reverse playback, 10 seconds. Stop there. Enhance image, 20%. Ugh, whatever. Integrity weed? Isn't that your dad's old marijuana? Oh, sh So where's Randy? Is Randy dead already? Hi, welcome. <gasps> That's the diabetic kid! Hey, B, I haven't seen you in ages. I'm sorry, do I know you? Well, sure, it's me. Scott Malkinson, remember? That's his last name, Malkinson. Oh, yeah, sure. Great to see you again. You don't remember him, bro? Malkinson, I went to school with you guys. Oh, okay. Damn. Hello, welcome. Hi, hey, hey, it's me. With the diabetes. No? That's 
The Kelly touched all of our lives and made each and every one of us laugh, cry, and ponder. Are we happy? Are we the person we hoped to be? Have we, like Kenny, given all that we can to forgive those around us? You know, in many ways, death is like diabetes. You spend your whole life trying to fight it off, but ultimately, it just wins. <laughs> to tell our mothers and our fathers that we all are... All right, all right, who the f*** you up to this? Did you write this goddamn speech, Kyle? Damn. Did you tell him to say all this stuff? So him and Kyle are very alike. Because he's thinking Kyle's doing that to him. Just like Kyle thought that Cartman was full of who I don't want to face. That's crazy. And you'd be able to face what happened to your family if you weren't a Guys, please. This is a house of God. You shut the fuck up. <laughs> and I'm going back home to the city. My child, please. We are gathered in Christ. My child, please. We're gathered in Christ. I'm Scott Malkinson. I have diabetes. Hey, he remembered him. He does remember me. <laughs> <laughs> start the car where are you going i need to stop at a store and then we're going home oh you want to get drunk let me guess someone said something you didn't like and it made you want to pound beer and wine Damn. it's not pounding beer and wine i drop wine shots into the beer it's called a smorgasbord and it's very cultural wine shots into the beer okay never heard of that before she hates when he does that. My name is Rabbi Cartman, and I was Kenny McCormick's very, very best friend. But he had so many amazing Jewish qualities. Qualities that I see in my loving wife and my amazing kids. And as we all return now to our homes and our lives, I think that a lot like Abraham, let's not forget Excuse that me, everyone? Hello? Everyone, can I have your attention, please? And we now know the cause of his death. What is it? Now we all need to stay calm. There is no reason to panic. But Kenny died of sports program variant. <laughs> Damn, so this back. Huh? They about to buy up all the toilet paper again. Yup, there it is. That's it. Damn, no more chin diapers. You really got to trust your car to sleep while it drives. Now, that's scary, bro. What is this, martial law? Social distance and stay indoors. Thank you. Next, please. Here, and I don't have anywhere to stay. They've shut down all the motels. Well, do you have any friends or family you can stay with? No, these people are not my friends, and I have no family here. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> They've set up an emergency shelter for all the people who are here from out of town. Nah, they, they scratch his brain with that one. South Park. No, he lost his hair. I don't want to hear any gender specific language in here. Now nah, that's crazy, sir. All right, thank you. It is now 901 Lights Out. Then they got solar. It's been a long time since I've prayed. I know in my heart that Kenny didn't just die of some new variant. I know there's something way bigger going on. But it all seems like so much to take on. It would be a miracle. Oh, sh Guys, no! 
God damn it! The school is all filled up and the motels are shut down. I was I was just hoping maybe we could crash here. I don't think that's gonna work. Well, I figured Stan is probably staying with you too. No, no, he's not. Oh great. Then you have some extra rooms. Damn. We're gonna be okay, kids. Yay! Oh, my family would be really comfortable in a nice Jewish home. Please, Kyle, for my kids. We promise we'll be good, Uncle Kyle. Please. Uncle Kyle is crazy. Put them right to bed. You won't even know we're here. I don't know, man. Like, just off of, like, let's say I'm Kyle, right? Just my history with Cartman and it being what it was for so long. I don't know if I'd be able to trust him even after 40 years. You know what I mean? Because this whole time you've just been a conniving son of a bro. Like, I don't think, I, I don't think he's changed. You feel me? Suddenly dies of some new variant. You think it's a cover token? I think it's definitely suspicious. Speaking of suspicious, what do you call a trans woman that walks into an abortion clinic? Fantastic person. Just seems all nice and buttoned up, doesn't it? It's a perfect cause of death, and anyone who's trying to sort it out is quarantined. It's true. Who wouldn't be by now? I'm certainly Yeah, I... Me too! Yeah, I mean, I, I think it's a personal choice. It's him. Immunized. He's not... He's a... Hey, I just, I just need to see the research first, you know? Alexa, set an alarm for 7 a.m. Alexa, set an alarm for 7 a.m. Why don't you go talk to your father? God damn it. Oh, so he is alive. Poor you. Stop being a f***ing victim. At least you get to go out and do stuff. What do I get to do? Again. Again, it's crazy. Sure, yes, tell me more. After you just embarrass his ass, you still trying to advertise to him? <sighs> yes, sure, add them to my shopping list. Okay, I'll add Mark 7 headphones from Best Buy to your shopping list. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, you like that? Yeah, 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 you like how Abraham trusted in the one true God? <laughs> oh, oh sh sh hey, hang on, honey, hang on. Nah, he was smashing the out of that what are you talking about you know what i'm talking about you know i can hear you through the walls okay geez i'm sorry sorry i was making love to my wife is everything all right do you know that your husband once stuck in my room and gave me aids i'm sorry oh my god cat oh my god i don't know what to say mom dad is everything okay it's all right kids go back to bed i promise you that we will be gone first thing in the morning that's probably best he still won't continue to smash the watch. Sir, the townspeople are demanding to know when the quarantine will end. It'll end when we get the order that everything is safe. They're saying they don't have nearly enough chin diapers and people are starting to fight. I have strict orders not to let anything in or out of this town. Hopefully they can maintain some sense of humanity. We got a runner! Another one trying to get out! Just need to go to a sporting event! Oh! Yeah. Hey, Clyde! Clyde, can we talk to you for a second? Look, Clyde, we all really respect your personal preferences. P -p preferences? People who need us. But, but, but we're being forced to stay here, so could you maybe just... Um, nah. I don't wanna. Yeah. Uh -huh. Look, I'm sorry, guys. It's for health reasons. I can't get vaccinated because I'm allergic to shellfish. I know, but I read that sometimes in the lab where the f*** is made, if somebody ate shellfish, then it can get cross-contaminated and have leftover residual shellfishness. Out of shellfishness. Yes, that is correct. Shellfishness? <laughs> Wing at South Park Elementary. Yeah, so I read about this. Kenny donated tons of money to build a science center for the students. Damn. Whoa. And he was doing all his research. He Why is there blood everywhere? Everywhere. Everybody see what you can find. There's got to be a clue here of who killed Kenny. Yeah. You and me, we are all living in the future. We are all fastest growing retirement in Park County. With our newest tower, we can now house over 600,000. All right, all right. Is he about to be looking like uh, Grandpa? I think I just seen the, the took our jobs guy. Visit my dad. 
Mr. Marsh? Mr. Marsh, guess what? Your son is here. I don't have a son. Oh, Oh, what? He can write an email. Tell that little if I had any grandkids, maybe I wouldn't be so bitter at having such a little for a son. Damn. So, looks like the Broncos still suck. Yep. What's all that energy you had towards them? Trust me, I don't want to be here. Right, like you didn't want to murder your sister. What happened to Shelly was your fault, not mine. What the f Yes, it actually was. Oh, sh Can y'all fill in the blanks, bro? What the f am I missing here? Why would he have integrity in his equations? Dr. McCormick mentioned integrity? It seemed to somehow f Come on, bro. It was the way to fix it all. He knew about the pandemic special. It's not safe outside. Oh no, this is just like when our people were exiled from the Holy Land. <laughs> Mrs. Cartman, can I talk to you, please? Uncle Kyle! Uncle Kyle, why are you making us go? Why? Damn. Tired, and it was extremely inappropriate of me. Dad! I think Uncle Kyle's gonna let us stay, Papa. Please stay. I am asking you to stay. Can we, Dad? We'll be good, we promise. You little ones are always good. Not speed laughter tea. Stop it! <laughs> Someone is at the door, yeah! Nah, that shit's annoying. They killed Kenny because he was trying to stop it. Stop what? We found Kenny's lab. All of his confidential work and his wild experiments trying to go back in time and stop the pandemic from ever happening. Oh, sh people it's four o'clock you know what that means it's share time look at carmen's mom garrison i'd like mr garrison feelings is hard during this time of crisis is anyone feeling nervous about the new outbreak because you know it's the future we all do everything we can to make sure old people don't die randy marsh had a little visitor today and he'd like to share that with all of you son who hasn't come to see me in over Son. 20 years. Damn. He killed his mom and his sister. Oh, here we go, here we go. After the pandemic, my mom wanted a divorce and she owned half of the farm. She right. didn't own half, she always hated and she didn't do for the farm. Burned the whole stupid farm to the ground and his sister was in the barn and she burned to death. Because you locked her in the barn because she wouldn't do her chores because she hated too. Oh. And so she herself, which is your fault. You are the one who burned the family business to the ground. You guys are hearing this, right? Then suddenly Kenny dies, and all his fellow scientists go missing. Just leaving behind a trail of blood. Oh. Seems like all of the scientists were murdered so that nobody could complete Kenny's work. Wow. Victor Chaus. Who is that? He's been locked up for years inside a mental institution. Okay. Oh, come on, now we're gonna start talking to certifiably crazy people? Crazy or not, we find this Victor Chaus. Now that place looks creepy. Yeah. Looks like some Batman. We have reason to believe that Victor Chaus could answer questions regarding our friend's death. Could you put him on the line, please? I'm afraid that's impossible. Well, can we come talk to him in person then? Yes, I believe that could be arranged. As long as the proper protocols are met. Is everyone in your party? Oh. <laughs> but we have to talk to him. It's urgent. You don't have to go. He, he but he didn't tell him all the detail. I need to take my dad out of here. He has to come with me. I'm afraid that's impossible. Senior citizens are in here to keep them safe. You know, it's the future. We can't let old people die. I just need him out for a couple hours so we can get something important. Well, why don't you just go get it? Because he won't tell me where it is because he doesn't trust me. Because he killed his mom. What if you took him out there and God forbid he crapped his pants and then slipped on the old people diarrhea and hit his head? We'd have to shut down the entire country for Christ's sake. Kick him in the ball, Stan. Oh, sh in the balls. Come on, hurry. Get your hands off of me. Run with it, bro. Kick him. Oh. 
of these documents we found in Kenny's lab referred to possible origins of the coronavirus. He wanted to go back and stop it. There's notes, years and years of research that Kenny compiled, all on the possibilities of time travel. <laughs> Who's the little Mr. J? Who's the little Hezbat? Who's my little machine? Jeez, sorry, cow. Kenny was researching the nature of space time to see if some kind of big. I mean, he's trying to raise his wife up. You feel me? Nothing wrong with that. But there is definitely a time and a place for that. You feel me? And right now, trying to figure out what happened with Kenny is definitely not, not the right time or place. Kenny, before he could go back and stop it. Kenny, <laughs> girl. Yeah. Will you please knock it off? God damn it. Why don't you lay off my dad, Uncle Cal? Oh. Uncle Cal, he makes me so crazy. That is not okay, Moisha. <laughs> but it's true, Dad. Uncle Kyle makes me crazy, too. Uh, Minora. <gasps> Damn. The hatred is real. Like, it runs in the blood. You feel me? So his kids got it. Think like kids again. I know where Kenny hid what we're looking for. Who's the broad? Who's the broad? It's the best you could do, huh? Is it even the new one? Excuse me? Damn. Just ignore him. Not now, please. Okay, so I guess just f me then. Uh huh. Oh sh. This was once such a magical place. Nah, I feel you, bro. And your mom and your sister. <laughs> <laughs> you selfish. F I think I can trust you now, Stan. It's time for you to learn what your friend Kenny was after. Yeah, I do. We as Americans went through so much. First, that incompetent jackhole was elected president. Just when it seemed like we'd turned a corner, Space Jam 2 came out. And we oh. all just kind of gave up. What Have y'all seen the, the, the Space Jam with LeBron James? I haven't, bro. I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all. I'm a Jordan guy. You know what I'm saying? So I've seen the OG plenty of times. But the um the jump with LeBron never. They needed us to lose it. Who did? Who would want us to lose our optimism and start fighting with each other? They're the superpower now. The future is totally theirs, and we let it happen. A man in China had sex with a pangolin, and that started. That man was me. Yes, but that's besides the point. China used me like they used us all. So I came up with a way to help everyone fight back. A special integrity weed. You had sex with a pangolin in China. Yeah, don't let that go, because he's trying to, like, move past it. They even got to my son, who burned all of Tegrity Farms to the ground. But what you didn't even know was that I had secretly created a new strain of <laughs> hid it away all these years. And now it is the key to saving us all. Bro, this better not be the post movie or post special. Where the is it? What? The Tegrity Weed special event. Where the they got it. Yeah, no, it was definitely the Chinese. Oh, God. That was it. That was the very last bit of integrity. The only other thing I had were some seeds that I hit up my ass, but they took them from me at the old folks' home. Oh, I said I hit them up my ass. It's so simple. How did we not get it? Alexa, start the car. There's no point now, son. It's all gone. It's all lost. You just left them? Who was that? What was that? Uncle Kyle. Uncle Kyle. Say it, Hakim. Uncle Kyle. Get cap. <laughs> Hakim, say uncle. Uncle. Uncle Cal. The hospital says we don't have authorization to see Kenny's remains. What? Sounds like someone doesn't want us to see Kenny's remains. Because we might find the truth. There has to be a way for us to get in there. <laughs> Take it, Cal. I can. What the hell are you guys doing here? Stan? What are you doing here? They won't let us into the morgue. Yeah, that's because you guys don't think. Excuse me, we need to examine the remains of Dr. McCormick right away. Like I told the others, only certified medical personnel are allowed to examine cadavers. Stan Marsh, consultant for the Postmortem Beverage Tainment Online Services. This is highly unorthodox. What the hell? Doctor, but luckily I am orthodox. <laughs> I don't think this is suitable. Orthodox Jew. 
I'm sorry, we can't supply any chin diapers. Just maintain social distance. Middle cabinet, second from the bottom. Middle cabinet, second from the bottom. Okay. Hello, old friend. Rides. <laughs> well, let's get them turned over. Now that's crazy. I better get some gloves. Cartman, go ahead. No, I can't do it. If anyone should reach up Kenny's ass, it should be you, Cal. I thought you were his best friend. I was his best friend, but I am also married, so I can't be fingering people's. You did not fix everything. You just started. Is that a pimple on his ass? You got all self righteous about everything. I got self righteous. Yeah, you got self righteous. They're having a whole convo while his hand is up his. Oh, ew. What are you working on, Clyde? Uh, I'm going through Kenny's journals again to try to find some answers. Seems like we just keep hitting dead ends, you know? You want to maybe do a little... Huh? I was just... <laughs> some of that coca? Party. Really? Yes. Oh, I'm so glad you're down. Nobody else is even cool enough for me to ask. It's pretty good too. <sighs> Wait a minute. What is this really? What do you mean? This isn't. It's the. Isn't it? I'm not putting that in my body. Oh, it's a setup. God, we want to get out of here. My body is a temple, and I'm not taking that. Let's just face it, guys. It's over. We did it. She's holding that shit with no gloves. Disgusting. Dr. Kenneth McCormick will now be attempting to travel back in time in order to stop the pandemic from ever happening he did it in the event of dr mccormick's death he wants everyone to know the group that is responsible for the way things are it is quote my three friends stan kyle and Carton. oh friendship and became argumentative combative pessimistic Damn. he says he hopes you guys are watching this he spent his whole life trying to fix your bro ship and then realized this was the only way because you guys suck wait dr mccormick you forgot your chin diaper Something's wrong. oh sh all this time the bad guys we were after who Kenny said ruined the future was you guys? Wendy, I've been trying not to say anything, but your friends are all kind of bags. Whose man is this? This guy. We lost that. We lost our sense of fun, our sense of humor. Maybe the pandemic was a big test and we all failed. Yeah, Kenny was right. Back in the old days, we wouldn't give up like this. And what we should have done then was double down on our respect and our love for one another and fight through it instead of fighting with each other. Damn, real shit. Start by believing in each other and in what is yet to come. We have to go back to being those kids we once were. Good, I'll be right back. Where's he going? Moisha, how come? Kids, get your things, we need to go now. What's going on, Dad? Your Uncle Kyle wants to go back and change things. He's going to try and change the past. No, kids. F Uncle Kyle. Yay! Oh, wow. He doesn't want shit to change. It wasn't your fault. Oh, it was their ghost. Thanks for saying that, you guys. I'm sorry Stan sucks so hard sometimes. Don't give up, Randy. Humanity needs you. No. It's sprouting, bro. The last little sprout of integrity. We have a lot of work to do. You're quite a popular man, Victor. Who else is calling for him? What all the fuss is about. Who the f is this Victor guy? Victor Chaos. We are you and me. We are Victor Chaos. Is that Butters? Professor Chaos? Please tell me there's a part two to this. There's no way this is where it ends. There's been a whole hour already, bro. 
Damn. Nah, I rocked with it. I rocked with it. Sound off in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know how it all went down when it first dropped. Because obviously I got into South Park after the pandemic. You know what I'm saying? I'm curious to see how this was received by everybody and what your thoughts on it were. You feel me? But listen, man, I appreciate you pulling up and watching this video with me. If you enjoyed it, you know what to do. Go ahead and smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't yet. And join the family. Till next time. I'm out. Peace.